Shalom Be'er of Tov. My name is Rabbi Deborah McKenzie, and we will begin our Mari service in about six minutes. Hello, Troy. How are you? I am in for Rabbi Galit tonight. Hello, Sue. How are you? I'm in for Rabbi Galit this evening. <laughs> Trey, I am doing well. Thank you. I like that howdy. <laughs> we'll begin our Maori service in about five minutes. I hope so too. I have not heard from Rabbi Judy in some time. We'll begin our Mari service in about three minutes. So are you two still in the middle of heat wave or is it starting to show some relief where you are? Shalom Anonymous. 
We will begin our Marie service in about two minutes. So both, so everyone's getting rain. What about you, Troy? Not too bad. Our heat wave is kind of settled down. It's still warm, but it's it's cooler than it was. Yeah, it, it's. So we're somewhat similar, Troy. Um, we've been getting storms, and so things have been cooling down a little bit. A little bit. The love the air of Tov, everyone. My name is Rabbi Deborah McKenzie, and I'm located in Clarksburg, Maryland, which is a suburb of Washington, D.C. I'm also a JSLI rabbinical school graduate, and tonight I am in for Rabbi Galit, who's not able to be with you this evening. That being said, it is an honor for me to be with you and to dive in with you this evening. Uh, for our Ma'ariv service, we will be using the weeknight tab, and we will also use the chat and social stream functions. And so with that, let's start on page two with the Hinemato. Hine matovu manayim, shevet achin gam yachad. Hine matovu manayim, shevet achin gam yachad. Hine matov, shevet achin gam yachad. Hine matov, shevet achim gam yachad. Hine matov umanayim, shevet achim gam yachad. Hine matov umanayim, shevet achim gam yachad. How good and pleasant it is for brothers and sisters to dwell together. We'll now go to page three for the Baruchu. Baruchu et Adonai Hamvorach. Baruch Adonai Hamvorach Leolam Vaed. Hello, Anonymous. My anonymous is, my name is Rabbi Deborah McKenzie, I'm in for Rabbi Galit, and we are using the weeknight tab for our Mari service this evening. And we are going to page four for the Ahavat Olam in English. Everlasting love, you offered your people Israel by teaching us Torah and mitzvot laws and precepts. Therefore, Adonai, our God, when we lie down and when we rise up, we will meditate on your laws and your commandments. We will rejoice in your Torah forever. Day and night we will reflect on them, for they are our life, and doing them lengthens our days. Never remove your love from us. Praise to you, Adonai, who loves your people Israel and everyone from around the world. 
before I go on, just want to comment a bit on the Shema. As this week, we read this wonderfully powerful declaration of our faith in Parshat Ve'at Hanan. The verses before it talks about keeping the commandments and the verses after it. The Ve'ahavta talks about keeping the commandments as well. But somehow between a land of milk and honey, the last words before the Shema, and you shall love Adonai your God, the words after the Shema, is a bridge that somehow encrypts Adonai's greatness, his reach, and his connection to us, and our connection to each other. For as much as these six words mean, and aside from reciting, every, reciting these words every morning and every evening, I have said it in all kinds of situations to bring myself to center and a place of calm and peace. Whether the occasion is happy or sad, I recited it at my father's deathbed. I recited the Shema as my nieces and nephews were crossing the threshold during their births. I sang it along with Hine Matov as a lullaby for all nine of my nieces and nephews when they were babies. And however, while I knew the concept of Adonai is one, or Adonai Echad, how powerful and intensely spiritual it is, it's taken me a long time to develop my full understanding of it, or a fuller understanding of it. One day I was looking up something science-y, because, well, I, I, I am a chemist, and, and an explanation of light came up. And then I heard an analogy by an author named Marianne Williamson, who used an analogy about light and electricity in the house, and compared it as a house with electricity to our spiritual source and humans as lamps in the house. The electricity is available for us to use, but until the lamp is plugged in, does the lamp not provide light? And I had an aha moment. We can have a lamp plugged in, but if the switch is turned off, we still cannot shine and our light still is not visible. The same electricity that is in my house is also in my neighbor's house and is also in the White House some 30 miles away from me. I realize that Adonai is one is about us plugging in and turning on that switch. As I reflected on my chemistry education, this concept is a repeated notion throughout the universe. However, Never is it stated so eloquently or in six words as is the Shema. Wherein is this Parsha, Hashem established the divine connection to us, our connection to each other, the bridge that connects both physical and spiritual into one. With that, let's go on to page five and sing the Shema. Shema Yisrael Adonai Eloheinu Adonai Echad Hear, O Israel, the Eternal One is our God. The Eternal God is one. Page seven, and you shall love Adonai your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your might. Take to heart these instructions with which I charge you this day. Impress them upon your children. Recite them when you stay at home and when you are away, when you lie down and when you get up. Bind them as a sign on your hand and let them serve as a symbol on your forehead. Inscribe them on the doorpost of your house and on your gates. I am Adonai, your God, who brought you out of the land of Egypt to be your God. I am Adonai, your God. Adonai Elohechem Emet. Now go to page 8 for the Micha Mocha. Micha Mocha Baelim Adonai Micha 
כמוך, נדר בקודש, נורא תהילות, אוסף אלה. Who is like you, O God, among the gods that are worshipped? Who is like you, majestic in holiness, awesome in splendor, working wonders? Now go to page 9 for the Chatsi Kaddish. Yit Kaddal, Yit Kaddash, Shemer Rabbah. Biyama divra kirute viyam lich malchute Bechaye chon uv yome chon uv chaye dicho bek Yisrael Bagala bagala uv izman kariv vimuru amen יש מרה במבורך, לעולם לא מעל מאיה יתברך. יתברך וישתבח ויפער וירומם ויתנשא. ויתהדר ויתעלה ויתעלה, שמי דקודשה בריחו. לילה מנקו ברכתה ושירתה. תוש בחטא ונחמתה, דם יירם בעמה, ואימרו אמן. We'll now have a moment of silent devotion. Now we'll go to page 12 for the Amida. If you are able to rise, please do so. Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Velohe Avoteinu Vimoteinu Elohe Avram Elohe Yitzchak Velohe Yaakov Elohe Sara Elohe Rivka Lohe Rachel ve'lohe Lea Ha'el ha'gadol ha'gibor ve'anora el elion Gomel chasadim tovim ve'kone ha'kol ve'zochel chaste avot ve'imaot u'me'vigola l'vne v'nehem למען שמו באהבה, מלך עוזיר ומושיע ומגן, ברוך אתה אדוני, מגן אברהם, יזרע שרה. אתה גיבור לעולם אדוני, מחיי הכל אתה, רב להושיע, מוריד הטל. מחכל חיים בחסד, מחיה הכל ברחמים רבים, סומך נופלים ורופא חולים, ומתיר אסורים, ומקיים אמונתו לשני עפר. מי חמוך בעל גבורות ומי דומה לך מלך ממית ומחיה ומצמיח ישועה 
ונאמר אתה לחיות הכל. ברוך אתה אדוני מחיי הכל. We'll now go to page 14 for the Aleinu. Aleinu l'shabeach l'adon hakol L'atet k'dula l'yotzeh b'reishit Sh'lo asanu k'yoye haratzot Velo samanu k'mishpechot hadama שלא שם חלקנו כהם לגורלנו ככל המונם ואנחנו קוראים ומשתחווים ומודים לפני מלך מלכי המלכים הקדוש ברוך הוא ונאמר והיה אדוני למלך על כל הארץ ביום ההוא, ביום ההוא יהיה אדוני אחד ושמו, ושמו, ושמו At this time, we'll go to page 16 for the Mishaberach. Please use the chat function or the social stream to type in the names of those for whom you would like this prayer said. Welcome, Anonymous 69220. We are using the weeknight tab for our Mishaberach, and we're on page 16. But we're using the weeknight tab for our Ma'ariv service, excuse me. And we're on page 16 for the Mishaberach. This time, please use the chat functions and social stream functions to type in the names of those for whom you would like this prayer said. And in the spirit of oneness, uh, when I say the name, when I begin saying the names aloud after the first Amen, uh, please, let's use our collective spiritual energy to envision restoration and gratitude for those who, who, who are in need of healing. Mishaberach avoteinu mekor May the source of strength who blessed the ones before us help us find the courage to make our lives a blessing and let us say Amen. We're saying a Mishaberach tonight for Russell. Amber, Marlene, Glenda, and I'm going to add Clara, Ernestina, Carrie, Fuzia, George, Martina, Anna, Pablo Inacio, Dana, Andrea, Neves, Valerie, Aaron, Maddie, Trey, Mayo, Malcolm, Barbara, Rose, James, Carrie, Albert, Joseph and Mary Aronofsky, Susan Gephardt, Jenny Bass, Williola, Sarah, Zechariah, Zephania, Sion, Larry, and Phyllis, 
Israela, Ariel, Rob, Josh, Sylvia, Austin Cohen, Ahavabat Miriam, Marionette Daniels, Tony, and Steve Davis. There are others, please type them in. And before we finish our Mishaberach, we'll say all the names aloud. Mishaberach imoteinu mikor abracha leavoteinu Bless those in need of healing with Shalema, the renewal of body, the renewal of spirit, and let us say Amen, and let us say God and the God of our fathers, hide not thyself from our petition and our plea. He'll restore and bring peace for those dear to us whom we have named, and for those who we hold in our hearts and minds, and for all your people everywhere. May it come to pass speedily in our days. Baruch Adonai, Rofe HaCholim. Amen. The Amen. Welcome, Rabbi Ruth Lesheva. For those of you who are in mourning or who are observing a yard site, this time please call, recall their names and join me in saying the mourners' Kaddish. Yet Kadal, the Yet Kadash, Shemei Rabbah. Bialmadi Vrakrute Vian Nich Malchute Bihaychon Viomechon Uchay de Hobe Israel Bagalau Vizman Kariv the Imru Amen Yehe Sheme Rabba Mevorach Me Olam Ulame Al Maya Yibrach Vi Shtabach Vi Paar Vi Roman Vi Nase Vietadar Vi Tale Vi Talal Shemei de Kudsha Brihu Leela Min Kobir Hata Vishirata Tush Behata Venechemata Da Amiram Beama Vi Imru Amen Yeshalama Rabba Min Shemaya Vahim Aleni Viako Yisrael Vi Imru Amen O say Shalom Bim Romav Huya say Shalom Aleni Viako Yisrael Yaakov Yoshvei Tevel, V'imru, Amen. May their names be for us a blessing, and let their memories provide comfort in their lives, serve as an inspiration for us to live wisely and unselfishly. And let us say, Amen. We have come to the end of our service this evening, and it is always, always a pleasure for me to dive in with you. Of course, Sims, you know, Sim Shalom has my read services every weeknight, Monday through Thursday with JSLI rabbis, and on Fridays, Kabbalah Shabbat with Rabbi Blaine, and bi-weekly Shabbat morning services with Rabbi Diane Rose. Also, if you haven't done so recently, please... Uh, check out the Sim Shalom website, read about the Give Peace campaign, the Meatless Mondays movement, as well as uh, purchasing a leaf or buying a leaf on the Sim Shalom Tree of Life in honor of a loved one. And you can also uh, find out information about the Sim Shalom High Holiday Services at the Bitter End in New York City, which they are coming soon, coming very soon. So before we close this evening, please uh, let me bless you with the threefold blessing. Yevrechcha Adonai v'yishmerecha, 
Ya er Adonai penavelecha vechunecha, Yisa Adonai penavelecha, Yasem lecha shalom. Bless you all. Thank you so much um, for for staying with me as I sit in for Rabbi Galit. Please enjoy the rest of your evening, and as we as we go forward into the rest of our week, Laila Tov, Shavua Tov, Erev Tov. Be safe, be well, be blessed, and be a blessing. Thank you.